what's the biggest issue with IPI for Amazon wholesale sellers is your in-stock rate because you get a lot of products that you're not able to replenish. Maybe you got them for a great discount um, or maybe it's a one-off deal, what we like to call opportunity buys. So you can't repurchase that product so it affects your in stock rate because Amazon saying, hey, you had this product that sold well, but now it's not in stock anymore. You should be replenishing this product, but they don't know that you can't get it anymore or you can get it, but the price is $5 higher. So that's why I never like to use Amazon's suggested or recommendations for replenishing inventory because Amazon, they don't have all the information. They just see, hey, this seller sold 400 of these in the last 30 days, we suggest you replenish this item. But they're not looking at the keeper chart. They're not seeing that four other sellers jumped in at $5 less and your your price can't compete with that. They're not seeing that your distributor's cost of goods went up 15% and now it's costing you $2 more. They don't have that insight into your business. Only you have that insight into your business.